increased inflation, increased mortgage rates, all of these things are coming together to create a perfect storm. And it's a really complex problem. And unfortunately, it's going to be complex solutions. The Calgary Food Bank says it's worried to see an increasing number of working Calgarians seeking food bank hampers as they're struggling to afford groceries amidst increasing housing costs and inflation. It comes as Food Banks Canada's annual hunger count report is released, showing usage of the resource has reached its highest level in decades. So these are folks who are going to their jobs, they're being paid nominal wages, and they just cannot make ends meet. And almost one third of our clients today cite working income as their number one source of household revenue. The new data shows nationally almost 2 million people used food banks in March 2023, a hike of 32% from the same period last year. You know what, we're living it every day, so these numbers that we're seeing in that um, hunger count report are re really reflected in the reality that we're living every day where we're seeing increased numbers of clients and citizens in our city coming to us and saying, we just can't do it, we can't make ends meet, we need help. The report also found a 78% increase in food bank clients since 2019. Fromm says what worries her the most is families with children as almost one-third of the clients that the Calgary Food Bank serves are minors, and that figure is steadily increasing. At the same time, she's glad the annual report has finally started the much-needed conversation. And so I think that's the first step, is that we need to start having the conversation at different levels of government, with different community organizations, and with our community at large. The Calgary Food Bank says they are overwhelmed, but still encourage anyone struggling to put food on the table to reach out for help. They also encourage Calgarians to donate not only money and food items, but also their time to volunteer at the food bank. In Calgary, Hena Said, City News.